This is Infinite Clicks. I'm Hank Thompson. That's Joe McAdam. I'm McAdam. Joe McAdam. Joe hey. McAdam. It's him. There he is. Hello, everybody. Hello there. It's me, Hank, the host of the show. Hey, buddy. How's it going, man? Good. How are you? I'm feeling really good today. I am too. And you know why? Because we're doing the show and I'm doing it with you, my friend. Yeah, you know what? I it's meant like you're my friend, not I'm calling you my friend. Like like people whose dads. Not enough drugs. is said about, you know, just really appreciating friendship. Exactly. So and I'm, it's I'm, nice. I'm glad to have it's, you in my life. It's through an amazing uh, sequence of events that we can be here. In fact, scientists, researchers, they call them sometimes, these guys are uh, space uh, scientists, discovered an amazing thing. They observed using NASA's Spitzer Space Telescope an eruption of dust around a star. And what they think it is is asteroids colliding smashing into each other, and I don't know if you mm -hmm. know this, but these things are moving fast. There's no speed limit in space. They're zipping around. There is a speed limit, actually. <clears throat> they can't go faster than light. I mean, they, they don't even really get close to that either. But they're going extremely fast, faster than our brains can really figure out. Yeah. And when they nail each other, uh, they believe they exploded into what they say is a huge cloud of grains the size of very fine sand, which yeah. are now smashing themselves into smithereens. But you know what? These all collect together and form planets. Slowly over time, this dust cloud comes together. It's yeah. called an accretion disk. It's yeah. fascinating. Smithereens, by the way, smaller than sand. So when I, you, go, you go to one of those smithereen beaches, whew, whew, it takes whew. years to get that shit out of your, you know, area, car. areas. Car. That's a car. Car's an area. Yeah. Um, Really cool stuff, actually. Uh, you know, it, it is a lot like how our solar system came together, as far as we yeah. can tell. And it is a pretty. Unlike, no, it's like it's like than getting that to witness Bible that Bible thing that says it just happened. But uh, yeah, so this huge thing of rotating clouds and asteroids are crunching and crunching and crunching and forming little balls, potato-like globs. Eventually, just it gets like to the potatoes. Point yeah, <laughs> it's exactly how potatoes. The potatoes grow. Is this how potatoes are formed? Uh huh. It is. And uh, I'm fascinated by this kind of stuff, though, this space thing. What's really cool is that we have the... I'm, I'm so happy to be alive at a time where we can see shit like this. In the past, yeah. they just look over at the sky and they're like, oh, look, it's fucking, you know, it's the God's dick and it's construction paper they with holes in it. They didn't say dick back then. Well, they, had, they had other words. They were more polite. They were. You need to watch Except your Except for all the slavery and rape that was all over back then. You need to use then. those words. So, uh, Using this amazing uh, telescope, um, they were they were observing what's going on around the sun. Unfortunately, because of the way our planet was moving around, our own sun, which we call the sun, yeah. uh, got in the way. This yeah. is a sad thing. It'll happen. So and they missed the impact. It's bright. It's very bright, and it happens to be very close. Do you know how far away the sun is from the Earth? Go. Um, it's about Earth to sun distance, so like right there. Nailed it. Perfect. Thank you. You got it right. Uh, when uh, space instrumentation on satellites and stuff, uh, it can't look at the sun unless it's designed for that. Otherwise, yeah. it will burn it out. You know how, like your mom told you, don't don't at the look sun. at the yeah yeah. Otherwise, your eyes will stay crossed. But you can do yeah, it a little bit. You can for go. A short you can go like this. You can go, and then and then and then. Or down. through the little you know yeah like that. Or like yeah, yeah you can do that. Or during those uh, sun 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 eclipses. Get a shoebox. Yeah, you, and and you or you could do two holes with paper. Yeah. Or one hole on yeah. Very fascinating stuff. That's not what these guys are doing. They have this thing. But we do have uh, something that will, I, I, I forgot how so, to say that part. <laughs> there's no footage of this impact That's actually it. happening, unfortunately. Yeah, we don't have footage of it. Yeah, but I mean, the good thing is, is that uh, we did come across, uh, we kind of have an exclusive with footage of the impact that created our planet Earth. So if we could watch that. Let's take a look. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, God. Oh, no. My whole life has been about this moment, Johnny. Oh, the head. This is horrible. I have gone deals. I do. Yeah. Oh, Johnny Utah. Yeah, no, that wasn't Johnny Utah. That, oh, was, that was Patrick. That was, that was uh, Patrick Nevada. Yeah, yeah, that's a great movie. That, that was Point Break. Ladies and gentlemen, we recommend you watch Point Break. That's right. Check it out. 
It's a thrill for children and adults of all ages. He punts a dog in it. That's my favorite part. I do. Right? Yeah. Well, he's like running through alleys and then he just drop kicks a dog. Does he pick it up and punt it? I Honestly, think so. I haven't seen it. Like in a about dog like jumps years. at him and then he like grabs it and then I think that's how it goes. <laughs> Either way, I know does I watched it, does it like a guy a come out and times. hold the dog like that and and then he backs up. Now that would be a kickoff, not a punt. I, I realize. <clears throat> but s send your corrections about how Keanu Reeves has kicked yeah. a dog. I like the. Was uh, it him? That's a great movie, though. I, I honestly, seen every, every bit of it is so. They, they have like a four-minute scene where they're falling out of the airplane just before that one, and they're talking. You can't have a conversation while you're descending through the atmosphere. It's bullshit. No, yeah, you can't hear yeah. a thing. His boss is that one guy from Scrubs. He's a real mean dickhead. He's super. He's like. Oh yeah, the rookie, yeah, yeah. The rookie thing. Like you're not gonna be like this, are you? I'm just like I'm just giving him a bunch of the shit right off the bat. That guy's a bat. great actor. He's I a really like good him. actor. He's still yeah. good stuff. He's got. He's in Office Space. Yeah, he's fantastic. Yeah. So follow him on Twitter. I think his name's uh, McGinley, right? Yeah, John McGinley? John, something like that. John McGinley He's on so Twitter. funny. He's really funny. Yeah. And he's also, he looks like one of those guys that would be like a really tough because he's kind of like, like you but know like some... But like secret tough? Yeah, like skinny. Like sk some skinny guys are really strong, you know, like yeah. skinny strong. He looks like that. Like he probably was never fat. He probably never was fat. They, they, guys like that usually have like really defined forearms and stuff, like these muscles here. I've been losing Got a them weight. Popeye arms. <laughs> no, 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 no. I've uh, I've lost some weight lately. I haven't noticed. <laughs> <laughs> it's not cool. It's so. Um, Space is the place. <laughs>